Hello everyone, it's Jin Teacher coming to you from Reading Town. It's good to see you. Let's take a look at today's article. So today's article is one of my favorite animals. I love the shark, right? I was very interested in them when I was little. And let's find out what it says. The title is Super Swimmer. So let's see what it has to say about the shark. A male mako shark has set a world record for the longest swimming distance covered in 600 days. So 600 days is almost two years. And it says, a male mako shark has set a world record for the longest swimming distance. So it's a shark and it's a mako shark. It's a type of a shark and they've set a record. So it's the most right in the world of how far they swam right in 600 days. It says nicknamed the energizer bunny, the speedy, the speedy fish swam a combined distance of 20,900 kilometers equal to the distance halfway around the earth. So I don't know if you're familiar with the Energizer Bunny, but a battery company, uh, Energizer Battery, so that's the name of the company, Energizer, they were trying to sell their batteries. So they had this bunny who would use a battery and it would constantly hit a drum and it would keep going and going and going and nonstop. And they call that the Energizer Bunny. And they say that this shark or anything that keeps going and going and going and not stopping, they use that nickname Energizer Bunny. So even though this is a shark and not a bunny, it's saying like that uh, character, the Energizer Bunny, this shark can keep going and going. It won't stop, right? And they swim so much that throughout 600 days, if you put all the distances, how far that they've swam all together, you can go halfway right around the world so they swim very very far right uh, scientists placed a tiny device in the shark to track its trip so a tiny means very small and device is a kind of a, a machine like a chip right like a little uh, machine chip that they put on the shark so they can follow it right using I guess GPS right um, and mako sharks are excellent swimmers with speeds of 35 to 80 kilometers per hour so not only are they good swimmers, they're very fast swimmers. And when you follow a mako shark like the scientists did, in 600 days, they can swim the distance about halfway around the earth. So in about uh, twice that, right? In about 1,200 days, they can probably swim the distance to cover, go around the world once. So we know that sharks are very dangerous, right? Uh, they're very scary animals, but not only that, they're excellent swimmers. They're very good swimmers. So very interesting to learn about uh, the shark. So here's another picture of the shark, a great swimmer. It says, Mako sharks are blank swimmers. So what did we learn? What word to say that they are very good? So we said it's excellent, right? They're very, very good swimmers. They're excellent swimmers. Then the second question says, the male Mako shark covered 20,900 something in 600 days. So when you cover distance, what do we use here? Uh, we use kilometers, right? In America, we use miles or feet, but here uh, and many places in the world, we use kilometers and meters. So they can cover 20,900 kilometers in 600 days, okay? The distance is equal to what around the world? Is it all the way around the world? Uh, is it part around the world? We said that 20,900 kilometers is about halfway around the world. So you're not quite going all the way around, but you're going halfway around the world. So that's a great distance that this shark can swim in 600 days. So let's find the right answer to our questions. It says the record breaking Mako shark was nicknamed the Energizer Bunny, labeled the Energizer Bunny or designated the Energizer Bunny. Well, designated is a similar meaning to labeled, right? So it's something that we call instead, but we didn't see that word in our article. Uh, labeled, I don't think we saw that. Uh, nicknamed, it might be the correct answer and it is, right? So the nickname that they gave the Mako shark is the Energizer Bunny. And I said the, en en the Energizer Bunny, it's a character that keeps going and going and going and not stopping. Uh, B, it says scientists placed a tiny chip a tiny radio or a tiny device in the shark to track its trip. Well, I said that the device is kind of a machine and I even used the word chip, but in the article, uh, it didn't use radio and it didn't say chip. So we know that the correct answer is device. So they placed a tiny device in the shark so that they can see exactly where and how far it's swimming. 
Last question, mako sharks are excellent swimmers with waves of, with speeds of, or depths of 35 to 80 kilometers per hour. So when we measure, right, how fast that they are going, right, 35 to 80 kilometers per hour, are we using waves, speeds, or depths? Depths means how deep it is, and the correct answer is speeds. So we learned today that the male mako shark not only is it a fast swimmer, but it swims very long distances. So in every two years or so, it can swim halfway around the world. That's how far it swims to get its food, right? Uh, or um, find its family and friends. So these sharks are extraordinary. They're excellent swimmers. So now you know this and you can share it with your friends. I hope you enjoyed today's article. I hope you do well and I will see you again next time. Goodbye everyone.